recording. Okay. Hey guys, it's Sarah. Hopefully you can see this video. If not, then apparently I must be retarded. Yes, I'm very mad right now because that is rude. Very, very rude. Just because you don't agree with somebody's opinion doesn't make you a retard. I'm sorry. I don't understand what I did so wrong. I'm making YouTube videos to try to save a pastor who's being tortured in Iran and covered with lice, and apparently I'm a retard. Maybe the person who wrote that should be more thankful for their freedoms and thankful that they don't have to deal with it. I'm sorry, but that is rude. So Dustin Lee 01, I don't want to start a war, but leave me alone because I'm not retarded and that's rude. And if you think that an American should be left for death in an Iranian prison, then something is wrong with you. And I seriously mean that. I'm serious. I'm so offended right now. That is rude. Like, nobody comments on any of my videos. And then somebody all of a sudden comments and says, Oh, you retarded with no other explanations? That's super rude. And I watched your stupid video, by the way, if you want to go there. And, um, yeah, that's offensive. First of all, I couldn't even finish the video because he said the F word so many times that it was giving me a freaking headache. Second of all, I'm glad that you have an opinion, but so do I. And that's what YouTube is for. Not to bash other people and be rude about it. I don't see why my opinion is so wrong. Yeah, maybe I don't like everything Obama does, but all I'm saying is that this guy and Amir Hakmati and uh, Robert Levinson should not be sitting in Iranian torture jails being left for dead while the country gets a bunch of humanitarian aid and money so that they can build more nuclear weapons and kill our people like they've already done. I mean, I don't know if you have a conscience, but if seeing little Jacob pray for Saeed Abedini doesn't break your heart, then something's wrong. Because I was, like, this close to tears. A little kid should not have to go through that, especially if their dad is an American citizen. Seriously. That is way too much for a freaking five-year-old to have to deal with. I did not know what is the deal with people lately, but there was, like... Two other callers on the Jay Seculo that were freaking psycho, psycho, and we're all like, blah, 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 going off like they think they're so smart, have it all figured out. Yes, Jay was very mad, I could totally tell, but, like, this guy gets on with all like, oh, you need to let the government do their jobs, and blah, 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 and blah, 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 and it's just like, seriously, man? They're not doing their job. Because if they were, we wouldn't be in this position or this situation. So, yeah. You can like the government all you want, but they're not doing their job and I don't. And they lied again. They lied about Saeed Abedini. They never did mention him. It wasn't even mentioned on the margins. So that was a lie. Another lie. So that's retarded. The government keeps lying to us, but apparently it's supposed to be okay. And I'm supposed to be a retard because I think an American Iranian pastor should be home with his family instead of covered in lice in some jail. Screw that. Because I'm to the point where I honestly don't care what you think. Because... This man is a Christian and should not be being tortured and having to wake up with people standing over him with knives. He's a freaking American. I don't understand what part of that somebody's missing. But they are. Like I said, I do not want to start World War III. So if I get any more comments that are super rude, I am going to disable comments, which I don't want to do. I don't know how, but I have friends and I will figure it out. And I will not reply if you're going to start a freaking social war with me. Because I'm not trying to start a war over whose politics are better. I'm not trying to start a war over what the government's problem is or problem isn't. I'm just trying to spread the news to get people to sign the petitions to bring this pastor home to his 5-year-old and 7-year-old and his wife, Nagme. And that's it. I don't want to have a political war. I'm not trying to start one. I'm just trying to spread the word and give people updates on what's going on. Because it's another 
medium that I have to spread the word. All I'm doing is trying to give people updates so that they know what's going on and telling them what I'm being told from ACLJ, which is not lies and they are not idiots. If you're going to go there, don't. I'm sorry, I've never made a video like this and I'm going to probably regret it because I'm not calming down before I make it, but I'm seriously annoyed. That is rude. I mean, I could understand if it was just a video about nothing and you were like, gosh, are you retarded? Like, seriously? But it's a video trying to help save a pastor being tortured, which is something that none of us here in America, thankfully, have to go through. Because if we did, I can guarantee you that most of us wouldn't be able to handle it. <sighs> Anyways, I have to go to bed. I have to work tomorrow. I don't know what else to say. I'm usually not offended by stuff like that, but that was seriously rude. I don't know what your problem is, but no, I'm not retarded. And I'm not trying to start a bunch of politics. I just didn't agree with the Iran deal. And I didn't agree that Pastor Saeed wasn't released. And neither was Amir Hakmati. And we don't know the location of Robert Levinson before we made the deal. That's the only thing that I'm mad about, which is the same thing that other people are mad about. I wasn't trying to bash Obama. I wasn't trying to bash the government. Even though I have my views, that wasn't the point. The point wasn't my political views. The point was trying to spread the word about a pastor who needs to come home to his family. Because that's where he belongs. Not in an Iranian torture chamber covered in lice. And being robbed at knife point. And if... People think I'm retarded because you can't see my videos because my screen isn't the way that it should be. I'm sorry, because usually it is. And nobody's been telling me that my videos are too bad. And I am blind, and I was born that way. Blind does not equal retarded, by the way, if somebody's going to go there. So no, I'm not retarded. I am blind, so if my video is not perfect, well, excuse me. I forgot that we weren't all born angels. Yeah, you know that sin thing? None of us are perfect. Because if we were, we'd be God or Jesus Christ, and none of us are. That's why Jesus died for us, because we're not perfect. So, yeah. Apparently, somebody forgot that, too. Anyways, for everyone else that actually cares about my videos and is trying to be informed, please help save Saeed. Sign at aclj.org or go to Save Saeed. Uh, sorry. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm so mad right now. Go to aclj.org or call 877-989-2255 to add your name to the petitions to stand firm for nuclear Iran and to stand firm, uh, to stand firm against a nuclear Iran. Oh, I can't talk today. Okay. I'm just going to totally start over. Just We don't want a nuclear Iran. That's bad. Okay, so what I'm saying is, sign the petition, if you haven't, to stand firm for Saeed and stand against a nuclear Iran. Ugh. Sign at aclj.org or call 877-989-2255 and add your name. Um, I will have a video later. I haven't been able to get caught up on the Congress hearings yet. And I don't care who thinks I'm a retard, I'm still making my videos because hopefully somebody out there is being informed and somebody out there is listening and somebody wants to save this pastor and I'm not psycho crazy and I'm not the only one. Hopefully. Because if I am, something's wrong with America and I don't think America's that messed up. Yeah, we have a lot of problems, but yeah. Anyways. So if you haven't signed the petitions, sign them, please. Help the poor man. He needs to come home. And for all of you who are really nice and kind, thank you. I'm sorry you had to listen to this. And I'm really sorry that I even had to do this. I was going to wait to make a video about Saeed when I get a little bit more information tomorrow night, hopefully, because I haven't had a chance to catch up on the hearings because I've been busy today. And I've had a lot going on, so I haven't caught up on anything. But I just needed to clarify to people that no, I am not retarded. 
Thank you for listening. God bless. Jesus loves you. Have a wonderful, wonderful night. And thank you for listening. Bye. Stop recording, but.